here. Hey everyone, welcome to Beer 30. I am Greg. With me is Josh and Josh. Um, I'm Josh. Yeah. <laughs> what, what was your name? Uh, today we're going to bring to you Intermission Ale from from Forehands here in St. Louis. Um, so this is American Blonde Ale, five percent ABV. And it's very limited. It brewed once, it says. Um, that's about all the information available on the website. So it's to celebrate the mu the Muni, which is our uh, municipal theater. Yeah, the theater here in St. Louis. It's um, 100 years that it's been there. So I guess this is to celebrate. Did you hear they announced yesterday they're like they're doing a bunch of renovations. They're getting a new stage. They're getting. Um, Get on there. What else? They added. They're adding a whole that. bunch. Yeah, they had a big to do up there yesterday. Um, I have never been to the Muni. Seriously? I mean, I've been there, but I've never seen a play or anything there. Really? Yeah. Isn't that weird? Didn't Didn't you just? I oh, know you've yeah, been a we, lot. Holy we just, cow! We just went to see uh, Meet Me in St. Louis. St. Louis. <laughs> but you've been oh, like your mom is a big Muni. Um, she goes to goer. the Fox. She doesn't do many Muni shows. Oh, okay. Um, but uh, we we went and last year we saw The Little Mermaid, and this year we saw Meet Me in St. Louis, which uh, it's one of Molly's favorite movies of all time. So, um, one of the cool things about the Muni is they have those free seat sections that you can. Uh, yeah, you need to wait in line a yeah, pretty long do, time for that. I don't do that well. <laughs> you don't wait well? No, in lines especially. <laughs> but um, actually, it's, I mean, it's an outside theater, so it's during the summer, it's going to be hot. Well, they improved the fan system, what, five, six years ago? Big, huge fans, yeah. yeah. Are they noisy? No, they're, uh, yeah, they're yeah, quiet. It's pretty yeah. wild how much air they get out of them. Are they big ass fans? Big ass fans. Yeah, that's they the could. company. <laughs> Is it? Well, yeah, I don't know. It is a company. I know it, it is a company. company but... I don't know if it is, but hmm. so the beer. Um, I mean, it's very light colored. Yeah. And this is probably what they were trying to do because they actually, I saw that I didn't get it at the Muni, but they do serve this there as well. So it's during the summertime. You want a light beer, refreshing beer. So yeah. I think this could be a little colder. Pretty really. Sad. Like it just doesn't feel like like this mm -hmm. style of beer seems like it should be. Cold, Pretty cold, cold. Yeah. yeah. It's not bad. It's a little hoppy. It is hoppy. It, it's, it's probably what mid thirties. I don't know. I was gonna try to look for that because it's, it's, you're pretty good is, at guessing those. I bet you it's mid thirty. It's five percent, so it's not like a high uh, five percent ABV. Right. Yeah. I didn't see the it's ABV on here. They don't have it on their website. I was looking for it on the Forehands website and I couldn't find it. <laughs> Probably uh, you know seasonal. Let's see. I mean, it's definitely yeah. seasonal because they have the Muni's calendar on the side here. Yeah. Well, if it's a one-time run, they may not. Yeah. Yeah, they didn't even put it on their website. Interesting. But what about collaboration? Uh, collaboration. Right. Oh yeah, yeah. No, nope. no. Nope. Interesting. <clears throat> it's not a bad beer. No, it's not bad. It's um not great. I mean, it, it it's light. It's it super kind of, clear, man. Yeah, it's super clear. I don't find it to be very refreshing, though. Like, No, it's no. a little more bitter than yeah, I thought. Better, yeah. I mean, it kind of stings your tongue. A little bit, yeah. Yeah. And it, uh, I'm, those IBUs are hitting close to 40, I bet you. Yeah, they do seem high. What, how do you spell this? Uh, so you can check on tap. That sometimes that, I thought Josh was on there. That's what I was on, yeah. Oh, you were on, I was on the Beer Advocate. Check on tab. I'm tapped. Um, but anyway, I mean, it's it's a one-time run. You know, sometimes are big hits, sometimes aren't. I guess, yeah. I've had worse beer. Put it that way. Yeah, yeah. There you go. So, um, I mean, what are you guys thinking about this? What's your, uh, what would you rate this? Oh, I'd have to go with like a probably like a C plus. Yeah. 
C plus. Yeah, I agree. I'm I'm right in there. I I would agree. Maybe maybe minus C plus. Um, it's not horrible. Like okay, <laughs> it's not the bottom of the beer. It's not the top of the beer. It's kind of sits somewhere in the middle. Mm-hmm. But it's also something yeah. that is not. Um, one that I would ever go. Oh yeah, I want to. I, wanna oh, have I wish they one. made that again. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. So on uh, Untapped, out of all the um, 352 entries, it ranks at 3.5. And then on or was like Beer Advocate, I think I think it ranked like about the same, about 3.5 out of five. Hmm. So. It's okay. I mean, for for being what it is, a special run. I, I mean, it's fine. Well, it's probably. Uh, hard to find now since uh, we're uh, out of the Muni season. I think they're on their last really? week. Yeah. yeah. Well, last week was last cool. week was yeah. probably their last week. Huh. So. But all right. Well, well, we got we got another show to start. Yeah. Here yep. Thanks, Greg. Well, see you next time. <laughs>